available experts, please report to room A9. Hello guys, Exo here, and welcome to Hiragana and Katakutna. These both have the same sort of idea, as in identifying the, the Japanese script character and entering the corresponding Romanji, which is basically what the English transcription of that list would be. I might be wrong here, but I think you can tell them apart because it's a very different, it's a slightly different shade of green. Because there's a vibrant green and a bold green. The other way to figure it out is, of course, if the characters don't exist in one of the sets of tapers you're looking at, it's probably, you're probably looking at the wrong one. So anyway, let's start with this one. This one, I think, might be Hiragana. And it will be this character down here. Uh, yeah. So we type in P O. We press Enter, and it shows us the next one. This timer up here. Don't worry about this timer. It's just a speed run timer to see how far you can do it. But we had to get five of these right to sell the module. If you get one wrong, you will still change the character, but it won't count towards your score. But the display character will change, but the stage number will not. So if you strike on stage three, you're going to do stage three again. Anyway, these doubled up characters use the dual characters table, using the last character as this column, as the column, and then you find it in the row. Emergency cleared. All personnel, please return to so in this case, this is JYO. This one is TSU. I think. Give it another one. <laughs> uh, yeah, that's fine. Uh, this column we get PYU. You can see these ones are basically all the accented ones, these ones are the normal ones, and these are the doubled up ones. Don't know if these are called accents, but this one is DE. Then we get this. Okay, so look. Oh. This stat slide does tell you which one's which as well. As in this one. It's probably going to be Katakana. And if we look, yes. Our first character is JYU. We found that. Okay, we're still looking at the same sort of place. Is HYU. Still in this tail. NYA. They're still in that table. KYO. He's because we've got, we've got all, all of them as double dot ones. MYO. And then we get so Katakana. I know they do these two again, but not like going back and forth and highlighting it just to show basically how you'd probably do this one if like you're ear filming it or something. Of course if you're expert in this you would have to describe these characters probably or solo it if you know them. So let's go with this one. This one is going to be This one. Then we have then uh, BYO. 
thing. Yeah. We have... I think that's Geo. And then... PA. There we go, there was a soul. Last one, there was a Katakana. Before, before I carry on, do note these characters up here for this one and these ones up here for this one are just single characters A E I O U and the N down here. Those are the only characters that will have one character. Anyway, let's go with this one. We start off with J Y O. Then we have Zero. Uh, KE. Uh, BYA. And finally, I think this is final one. Yes. And we have two sold Hero Gardens and two sold Cat Gardens. So, the concept of these modules is pretty sim similar. Actually, pretty much identical. <laughs> and pr pretty simple when you get the gist of it. Sure, describing the characters on a team bomb would be slightly difficult compared to just doing this on EFM or just knowing the characters off the top of your head. <laughs> Anyway, hopefully you understand how this module works now, and I'll see you guys in the next tutorial. I'll see you later.